On October 22, 2024, Lithuania made a significant advancement in its military capabilities by officially deciding to purchase German-made Leopard 2 main battle tanks and initiating procedures for acquiring Swedish CV-90 infantry fighting vehicles. This decision, announced by the Ministry of Defense, marks a crucial milestone in Lithuania's ongoing efforts to modernize its armed forces and strengthen national defense. The announcement followed a meeting of the State Defense Council VGT, held on the same day, attended by Minister of National Defense Lorinas Kasiunas and General Raimundas Vyksnoras, commander of the Lithuanian Armed Forces. The discussions focused on the progress of the National Division's development and the acquisition of heavy weaponry, with the Leopard 2 tanks being selected as the preferred option after careful consideration during previous VGT meetings. The Leopard 2 is widely regarded as one of the world's most advanced main battle tanks, known for its exceptional firepower, protection, and mobility. Developed by Germany's Krauss Maffei Wegmann, the tank is equipped with a powerful 120mm smoothbore cannon, advanced armor systems, and state-of-the-art targeting and communications equipment. Its effectiveness in both defensive and offensive operations has made it a cornerstone of modern armored warfare, and it is currently in use by several NATO allies. In addition to acquiring tanks, Lithuania is also focused on securing tracked infantry fighting vehicles, IFVs, to complement its armored units. At the VGT meeting, General Vyksnoras presented military recommendations on potential alternatives, while Minister Kasiunas highlighted the political, economic, and financial assessments carried out by the Ministry of Defense. The Swedish CV-90 infantry fighting vehicle, developed by BAE Systems Haglands, emerged as the optimal choice for Lithuania's requirements. Renowned for its versatility, the CV-90 is designed for modern combat scenarios and offers a combination of excellent firepower, mobility, and protection. With variants equipped with either a 30mm or 40mm autocannon and advanced command and control systems, the CV-90 is adaptable to a range of combat roles, from reconnaissance missions to providing fire support for heavier armor. Following these evaluations, the VGT has directed the Ministry of Defense to begin the procurement process for the CV-90 vehicles, which will enhance the operational capabilities of two battalions in the Lithuanian Army. This decision also emphasizes the importance of collaborating closely with Lithuania's domestic defense industry to maximize local benefits from these acquisitions. Both the Leopard 2 tanks and CV-90 infantry fighting vehicles are set to be financed through Lithuania's Defense Fund, demonstrating the country's commitment to enhancing its military capabilities amid a rapidly evolving security landscape. The Lithuanian Ministry of Defense has reiterated that these acquisitions are vital for modernizing the military and improving readiness to address current and future defense challenges. As Lithuania continues to invest in its defense infrastructure, the procurement of these advanced military assets reflects a strategic approach to ensuring national security and reinforcing its commitments to NATO allies. With the integration of the Leopard 2 and CV-90, Lithuania is poised to enhance its operational effectiveness and resilience in the face of potential threats. Thank you.